Hi BDC Curls, it's Melissa. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are going to talk about goals. So I have talked about what I wanted to do in terms of um, some goals, but I just wanted to give like an overall 2017. I feel like, you know, it's great to talk about goals, but it's more importantly to write them down. Okay, so the first thing I have in spiritual planning, like I said, is to pray, communicate with God. I get up every morning about 5 a.m. and we have kind of like a corporate prayer and we we pray for about 10, 15 minutes together as a group over the phone, which is pretty cool because it's East Coast, West Coast. People call in and we pray. And there is definitely a, there is power in corporate prayer, but I also want to pray and meditate by myself. The day after we have corporate prayer, I want to get back to, and my schedule has been kind of crazy, but I definitely, I think prayer is a necessity. It's not something that I'm going to just fit in. It's something that I feel like prayer has to be scheduled. That's just me. I feel like, especially when you have a lot of things going on, if I have 15, 20 minutes to spend really meditate and starting off my day with God, I have learned that my day goes so much better. In terms of fitness too, I do plan on drinking more water. I do have a Voss type of bottle and I want to say it's like 28.7 ounces. I plan on drinking like three of those a day. So I feel like if you have kind of like a bottle and you set it, okay, I'm going to drink this amount before 10 a.m. I'm going to drink another one before 2 a.m., maybe before 2 p.m. And then I have another one done by five. I want to have all my water drank before I head home just because it's so much harder to drink water once I'm getting the kids ready for bed or homework or meals and everything. So yeah, that's my goal. In terms of family, I do have some family goals for 2017. First of all, planning a vacation with the family. I definitely want to do that. So I am creating a budget for that. And that's later on in the year around summertime. So I'm definitely creating a budget and going to set aside some money for that. So planning for vacation is one of my goals to set up for the family. The other goal is to, by October, have all of the Christmas gifts done. Okay, and I put that under family just because that's not just me. I'm, I'm talking about getting gifts for everybody. And I don't like shopping last minute. I feel like you spend more money shopping last minute than getting it when it's at a good price. So I definitely want to do that. And then I also want to make sure everybody, like gifts are done by October. Okay, so let's talk about the channel. I was thinking about this really, really hard. And first of all, I have not come with talking about my hair journey here on the channel. And I was like, nobody knows my journey. Unless I've talked, I've talked about it on my Facebook page. But in terms of here on the channel, I think that that's important. So I definitely want to come and talk to you all about my hair journey. And also, I want to really emphasize on addressing problems and when i say if addressing problems not in a bad way i feel like in order to get great results you have to go straight for the juggler okay and address issues and that is in terms of natural hair in terms of beauty in terms of lifestyle we're going to address issues i wanted to do this video first we've i've already filmed with my husband a video in terms of dealing with the death of a child as a couple and how to overcome it, how God really helped us. And I think it will really bless you all because you all really, really gave me so much support in dealing with depression and death during the holidays. And I saw that it helped so many of you guys. And so I was telling my husband and he was like, let's do it. And he jumped in front of the camera. I was like, whoa. So he's already, we, him and I have already done that video, but I wanted to come with goals first because I feel like that one is really addressing an issue that we really need to talk about. And I feel like sometimes dealing with death because it is such a hard subject to talk about that sometimes it gets pushed to the side, but you still feel the effects of it and people still suffer in that and people are still hurting. And so I definitely wanted to come with this video 
detail about goals before I aired that one. Hope that makes sense. I definitely want to have him more on the channel. You saw he did my husband does my voiceover. I love I love that video. If you hadn't watched that, I hope you take an opportunity to check that out. I'll definitely link it down below or put it over here in the cards so you guys can check it out because yeah, he thought he knew what he was doing, but Lord, stay in your lane. You know what I'm saying? I talked about addressing problems. So I'll kind of come with addressing issues and I want to start back with the basics. Some of you all don't even know what hair porosity is. I need to address that. Some of you all don't even know what a humectant is or even know about natural hair vocabulary. If I talk about slip or if I talk about detangling or if I talk about prayer hands or scrunching or plopping. Some people don't even know what that is and sometimes we get I think sometimes as beauty channels, we forget that people don't know those things. So I want to start back from the beginning because I feel like a lot of beginners here on my channel ask questions and I tend to forget that you don't already know those things. So I definitely want to start from the beginning and then I can also reference back to videos and let you all know that, hey, I already have that video up. Please look down in the description box and then move on in a kind of like a flow, a cohesive structure to my channel. I hope that makes sense. Beauty content, I want to invest more into equipment right now. So that is a serious investment. So a lot of times you, in order to do that, you have to balance things out. So I am budgeting and I have some budgeting tips and yeah, so I'm investing more into my equipment. I really do want to upgrade the lighting my camera I want to like get a really great setup for you guys and it's not only for you guys I feel like it needs to be for me too I want this to be a space of zen that I can actually operate and it my videos just come out better so let me know one thing you plan on accomplishing in 2017 have you written it down do you have a planner do you are you brain dumping let me know if you've even heard about brain dumping. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to come with goals. Goals in 2017. It's all about y'all. It's all about us accomplishing them. And, yeah, hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe if you hadn't already. And I will see you in the next few days in another video. Bye, loveys.